everybody, what's good, what's good, what's good? Welcome back to another reaction video, y'all. It's your boy, Corey, man, and I'm back for another reaction video for y'all today, man. Hey, look, man, we got this uh police chase right here, man. About to react to this. I don't know any duties, but it's something new, y'all. You feel me? But, everybody, let's get it, y'all. It's Friday night, man. You know what I'm saying? Everybody that's going out, fuck it. Don't go out. Fuck that shit, man. You know about bullshit. Nah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead. Goddamn, do y'all. Go have a good old time. Go have a good old time for real, y'all. You know what I'm saying? If you're going out for real, be safe too, man. You feel me? But nah, let's get it right straight to it, though, y'all. This is going viral. Surveillance mode, but now that he's made some of these moves, they have given permission for the ground oh, units to re-engage. However, really they have hit. fallen back a little bit, and now you see he's got a lot of residential street to play with here without anybody behind him. He's basically zigzagging his way through the streets of okay. southwest L.A., uh, doing about 35, 40 miles per hour making very random turns. Uh, if there is a unit in the area, they were looking for a spike strip. But right now, these turns appear to be too random. Yeah, He's traveling said, no. too fast to really set up for a successful spike strip. So we'll see if there's anybody else inside the vehicle. A strong indication that he may be looking for an opportunity to just dump this vehicle based on some of these moves the here. Or he can keep it going. You just never know what's going through this guy's mind. It does not look like there's anybody in the passenger seat. And this again, they do not look. know what the original want was here for this video. We're getting some reports that it is a robbery suspect at the South LA police station. And we do know that there's some damage there to the passenger side, but we're not sure if that happened during this pursuit or not, but um, certainly uh, driving erratically enough to, to have that kind of... Uh, of course, have you heard of any collisions that he might have gotten into during this pursuit? What happened? We have not received word of any collisions, not to say that there haven't been any, but we are not aware of any, and it's certainly unclear whether this vehicle belongs to the suspect. You know, we say robbery suspect, we do not know if this vehicle was involved in the original crime. Maybe a carjacking, that could be a robbery, or maybe it's a GTA suspect with other crimes related to a robbery, or it is a we just don't know. So a lot of questions, but to answer your direct question, that passenger side damage, unclear at this point where it came from. A lot of unknowns here as they try and catch up with this suspect. Right now, he is continuing to move through South L.A. without anybody behind him. And I think as of now, L.A. County Sheriff is keeping an eye on him with their helicopter. So they do have eyes on the suspect. Hey, the It'll be interesting to see if they keep this in surveillance mode or do decide to re-engage considering where he is here. Yeah, we're traveling. Westbound on 58th place, coming up uh, just past Buckler, uh, continuing west here. Through, I want to say uh -oh. this is like Baldwin Hills area, uh, or just south of Baldwin, Baldwin Hills. Uh, now making a southbound turn. That's going to bring him much closer to LAX. And there are the black and whites. Two SUVs in position. Now making a left turn with him as he continues southbound on Overhill Drive. That boy moving on him, though. The street that's going to take him right into LAX's approach path, which would basically force them to call off that helicopter. And it'll come down to those ground units who are following right behind You saw two of them. Two black and whites. Now, now not too far behind, behind the suspect, the suspect who, was who was traveling at about 60 miles per hour down, down a residential street. street. Another, Another close call there as he made a wild, wild right turn, turn uh, as that street came to an end. Now turning on the Fairview Boulevard, again traveling at high speed through residential streets. Always a dangerous situation when we get to these residential streets, especially this time of night. 6 o'clock in the evening, a lot of people are not even out, it's been so hot during the day, but watching this guy drive right, right through, uh, plowing through these red stop, uh, red, red lights and stop signs as well. You just, just saw where there's, where there's almost a collision between the police pursuing him and somebody who is flying through that intersection coming the other direction, and that's part of the danger of these high-speed pursuits. It was, it was a great, great example of why they have, have to treat this so, so much more carefully than the driver because he just flew right through that red light and, and there was cross traffic. Had that black and white, that primary unit, 
not stopped for that red light, there would have been a major collision right there with that cross traffic. So he came to a full stop, even with the light siren they have to come to that stop, and then they will continue the pursuit through these intersections. Here comes a busier intersection. La Cienega, Fairview Boulevard, right through the red light, around traffic, into cross traffic, making the right turn, and narrowly missing that cross traffic there with vehicles flying through that red light. They had the green light, and now he's making the northbound turn onto La Cienega Boulevard. Those who are behind them may have fallen back a little bit, and they will come to a complete stop at that intersection. He actually, for a brief time, went into oncoming lanes of traffic to get around that red light into the north side of La Cienega Boulevard. We're now looking for an exit opportunity here. This is a transition road, I believe, that will put him back onto Surface Street. There's a black and white unit right there. That may be LAPD. They may or may not know what's going on. Here are those sheriff's deputies, two of them, those two SUVs, managing to navigate that busy intersection. And still, and still right behind him, him as he as makes, makes a left, left turn going, going westbound, westbound on Swanson Avenue. Avenue. Over, Over the media, desperate, desperate to get around, around these busy intersections. intersections. He's, He's going, going right, right into oncoming lanes of traffic, traffic to get... get I ain't gonna I ain't gonna ask you all this, y'all. I ain't gonna lie like damn bro. The bro don't know how to go. Dodge, dodge all of those, those uh those, those brake lights, lights there and, and they again are in a position, position where, they where they have to have fall back. back. So, so a, a very desperate, desperate driver, driver behind the wheel here, here who is not showing signs of giving up any time soon. soon. If there was any hope of him dumping the vehicle, it appears that the pressure they are applying is putting him in a mental state where he is just gunning it. He's basically blowing through every red light down and putting a lot of lives, lives at, risk at risk at the same, same, at the same, same time, time here, here not, not afraid to go, to go uh, the wrong way on some, on some of these busier streets here. here. We are in the middle, the middle of rush hour, hour as he continues westbound Slauson Avenue coming in from uh, 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 Bristol Park right away. Right. Right. In the, in the left, left turn, turn lanes, only to go straight through here, here cutting, cutting everybody, everybody off over the double yellow paint, and now you can see they are going to try and... Keep up, up with them, but this, this is getting, getting more dangerous, dangerous by the, by the second, second guys, guys, just by, by the erratic, erratic driving, driving that we're seeing. Absolutely, Absolutely. He's, he's refusing, refusing to stop. He's run a couple, a couple of. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna skip all of them. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying. Niggas gonna be talking. I'm gonna hear that shit. I'm gonna just get to the point, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on, y'all. Pipers on, on for whatever, whatever reason, reason. Uh, uh, unclear, unclear uh, what, that's what that's about, about but, uh, uh, you know, these guys, these guys do, sometimes, sometimes do crazy, crazy things for no reason at all, uh, uh, depending, depending on their mental state, state depending, depending on what's going, what's going on inside, inside that vehicle. vehicle. But again, again, he's just, just zigzagging, zigzagging through a very, a very residential, residential street, street here once again, in a back alley, this is Arab Drive, here right Crest Drive, and Blair Hills. These are all very residential streets with cul-de-sacs, dead ends, left and right. That's why I say, I just didn't think you can have an opportunity to get out of that maze in Culver City. We're now a little bit further south, not too far south, just south of Culver City. It might even be in the city limits, but he's continuing further south here now on the Wee Avenue, turning on to Stoneview now, Stoneview Drive, as you can see on SkyMap right here, one, two, three, SUVs, uh, uh, sheriff's, sheriff's explorers, explorers or, interceptors, or interceptors, I should say. say. Uh, uh, they, they are Ford explorers, explorers, highly modified, modified Ford explorers. Ford explorers. Uh, uh, they're, they're trying, trying to, catch to catch up with the suspect. suspect. Yeah, yeah, this, this uh, I, I, I don't, I, I, the, speeds the speeds are really, are really fast. fast. There's some tight some turns, turns, but there, but there wasn't, wasn't a lot of traffic, traffic in that area. I wonder, because they were really approaching the backside of him, if they would try to pit maneuver, maybe right here. He might be stuck. Maybe. Hey, bro. No, no, and he's, he's had, had a, a lot of opportunities, opportunities to just give this up already. already. You know, you he's know, had he's his, his, uh, his, uh, his time, time in the, in the, in the sun here, but I, 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 I just, just tell you, he is, he is really showing, showing signs, signs of desperation. You don't get the impression he's going to go very quickly. Now it's a dead end. Dead end, and now we'll see if he gives up. He's backing up. Deputies, with their guns drawn, the vehicle coming to a stop. This, this is precarious, is precarious guys. guys. He's coming to a dead, dead end here, here damn boy. with deputies with their guns out, pointed, pointed squarely, squarely at that driver's seat. seat. But, the but the behavior that we've seen here in the last few minutes just doesn't give you a lot of confidence that he's going to surrender. surrender. Let's hope that he does. Let's just hope that he makes twice about the million wise and just opens up that driver's side door. A similar incident reminds me of the shooting last week when there was an end to that shooting where the guy refused to take his foot off the accelerator, refused, refused to give up, even though one hand was out the window. window. That's, still That's still a controversial, controversial end of a pursuit. Of a pursuit. Here, we Here we have the door, the door open for something, for something similar, similar to happen, to happen here, depending, depending on what, on what he, decides he decides to do. To do.
The fact the that fact the door, that the door is, still is still closed is, closed is, not, is encouraging, not encouraging, but you're, but you're right, right, David. David this, this is the is most dramatic, dramatic well, no, bro, point, 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 of point of any pursuit. The most dangerous part of, in of a chase is, is when it comes to a stop, especially when the suspect is trapped and in a dead end like this, he's got nowhere to go, and he starts to analyze his escape routes. What are his possible options here? Now, now at his at disposal, his disposal. He's, communicating. he's communicating, he's agitated, he's rolling, rolling down, down the window, down the window yelling, yelling at those deputies, deputies. Yeah. He's not, not opening the door, the door. very oh, animated, trying, trying to yell at those deputies, at those deputies. It, is it is not encouraging, encouraging. He, needs he needs to calm, to calm down. down, and let's, and let's just, just hope, hope. Let's, let's just hope, hope that he takes a minute to relax, takes a deep breath, because right now, David, you're so right, this is looking a lot like that pursuit that came to an end exactly a week ago. Yeah, that was really a tragic ending to that pursuit that still did. Today. Uh, right, now, right now, we're seeing that, we're seeing person, that person who was in that driver's seat, which you could see how tinted those windows are, windows are but now you, now you can't see anything that's going, that's going on inside that vehicle, vehicle because of that, of that tent. tent. But, but that person, that person um, for, whatever for whatever reason, reason is extremely, is extremely agitated. agitated. I don't know, I don't know what, what you could be saying to law enforcement officers at this point when they have you dead to rights, you need to go, you have nowhere to go. How do you negotiate your way out of that? This is where, when it comes to somebody's fast, mental fast, state, fast, whether they're fast, on fast, something, fast, all, fast, all of that all comes into play and that consideration on how, on how to handle, handle a, suspect a suspect like this. Like this. Hold up. I'm gonna skip all this. I'm gonna see who's staying, bro. I wanna see you win that car, bro, because bro should have went ran, ran out of cars for see you feel me? Fuck, bro, cannot be that slow now, y'all. Fuck around with that boy. Hold up. Hold up, man. Is a, is a baby in his arms. A baby? That is a baby in his arms. And how did that baby get to the front seat? Is my son's question. Was he driving like that? With a baby just sitting in the back seat on his lap the whole time? I can't even imagine. I cannot imagine. But it appears to be. We'll see here. 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 A small infant in his arms. What? It's a woman. Is it a woman or a man? I can't tell. It's a man. It's a man. Either way, the suspect is stepping out of the vehicle from showing show of hands in the back seat. There is somebody in the back seat. There is somebody in the back seat. The passenger has now opened up the driver's side door in the back seat. You just can't believe that that person has just shown the LA, LA County Sheriff's Sheriff Department, Department on a wild, wild and, and dangerous pursuit, pursuit in the middle of the rush, rush hour with a, with a baby, baby in that in vehicle, vehicle and other people inside of that car. This is just incredible. Uh, baby and it and it and uh, wait, cooperates for you. a girl on that joint too. Bro, are you, this thing is freaking slow as shit for real, bro. Like, real live, bro. You know what I'm saying? Boy, he bad that be no motherfucking criminal blood, man. He a lame man, nigga, fake ass street nigga. But real life show, but I, yeah, bro, 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 you should have told your girl and and and, and take take the baby, run off, whatever, do something. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't be having that doing it like a police speed chase or whatever with your baby in the car and your girl in the car. Let him step off, bro, and you do your thing, man. These niggas is not, bro. These niggas is weirdos, y'all. These niggas is weird as shit out L.A., bro. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. You L.A. niggas is weird as shit for real. I'm the person in the back seat yep. with the baby. Yep. With the baby. Okay. Okay. Here's your girl. A woman out of the back seat with child. Driver stepping out of the car. And now, okay, this, this is... Oh, baby. Oh, no, no. no I'm never gonna see you. I'm not gonna see you no time soon, hot ass nigga. She gonna fuck around, fuck with another nigga. It might, when I might slaughter her damn nose. Like, I'm gonna see him find her IG. She gonna know, like, you heard me. You know, back y'all. Like, I'm gonna find her IG. She gonna be with me. You niggas gonna be mad as shit. I know what I be crushing y'all baby mothers. And y'all niggas be in jail mad as shit. Look at that niggas. I'm out here with your girl. Boy, just imagine that. Boy, Corey Method child, the girls, the baby mothers, and all that. Like, y'all mad as shit, sick as shit. Just imagine your girl ain't picking up the phone, man. Yo, boy, you trying to call it. You been... Man, my motherfucking girl, man, I ain't picking the phone. Got it because I'm crushing her for a real ass, y'all. Hey, look, y'all be cool. I ain't be cool, bro. This shit is sad, y'all. This world, y'all. This world all retarded. We just fucked up and everything. You can make me a little hell. Y'all stay in the angels right here, man. Y'all let me know in the comments down below, man. If you ain't you ain't no real nigga, if you do this type of shit, bro, you should let your baby in, uh, 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 let your girl take the baby and all that and kick off somewhere. You know what I'm saying? Not pee, bro. These y'all, hey, females, ladies, 
Be careful who you date, bro. Be careful who you, you know what I'm saying? Let a nigga put a baby in man. Be careful who you fuck with, fool, bro. It's lame niggas like him. But ruin your life, put you in a situation like that. A real man ain't gonna put you in a situation, situation like that, bro. A real man gonna bring you some peace. Remember that? Remember that shit. All y'all females want street niggas and shit. You know what I'm saying? Fuck. Bum ass niggas and all that be putting you through some shit. You ain't, you know what I'm saying? Can you, can, you can't even get yourself out. Out, 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 out. Out of most of them, you know, you know, but now uh, y'all be quiet, be cool, though, man. Peace.